Well, happy Wednesday, everyone. The next system, it's here right about now. Early this morning, it's passing on through, making its way further east of the Cascades by about noon or so with a chance of rain and snow and snow levels still pretty high up there. If you didn't see snow yesterday, probably not going to see snow today and even less of a chance of seeing snow today. Really, the system for the most part is actually staying off to the north of us, but we do have the tail end of it, so it's not really the heaviest rainfall amounts, but some decent amounts possible out on the coast, about an inch or so for the North Bend area. This will continue to move Move on further to the east and as it does off to the north and to the east, it breaks apart just a little bit. Go later in the day on Wednesday. This is 730 PM predicted later today. Actually starting to clear things out a little bit, maybe even a little bit of sunshine. Of course, before 730 PM by that point, the sun is setting. Let's keep on going through Thursday and while the system is still out there, still this band of showers, it's again mainly staying off to the north of us as we build in not the strongest ridge, but enough of a ridge to keep us mostly dry through a good part of Thursday and then that ridge starts to tilt just a little bit and as it does instead of staying off to the north you build this trough out in the Pacific and that'll bring more rain to our area as we go into early Friday morning into a good part of Friday and then eventually head into Saturday especially late Friday into Saturday another chance of rain on the way so mostly dry as we get later in the day on Wednesday after after some rain this morning and then we go into Thursday mostly dry through Thursday until Thursday night and then Thursday night into Friday morning or potential of rain so on again off again showers really throughout much of the next few days that's so what it looks like like out there, the main low off to the north of us right now, that band of rainfall staying mainly to the north, but we get these little cutoffs from that area and we see that potential for showers like what we're seeing this morning. So look at some of the shower activity early this morning, more patchy drizzle in some spots, more heavier rainfall out towards the coast, a little bit of snow, but again, snow pretty high up in the mountains early this morning. In terms of potential for precipitation in your pinpoint forecast, most of that's staying out on the coast, of course, but some higher elevations of Josephine County has some chances. Let's go into the afternoon. You can see that breaks apart for a good part of the day in the valleys. For example, the Shasta Valley looking more on the dry side of things. You tend to see that with higher winds as well. It could be a little breezy out on the coast, but this does bring more potential for rainfall and some rain and snow way up there. You can see Crater Lake, for example, you got to go way up there to find anything coming down as snow. Head into Thursday. One more look at this. The potential mainly staying off to the north of us, eventually tilting into our area. Some heavier rainfall possible at times as we get into the night on Thursday. Then Thursday Thursday into Friday morning, start to clear things out just a bit later in the day on Friday. So on again, off again, showers. Rain then showers for the coast today with some breezy winds and some fog. Temperatures mainly in the 50s, mostly cloudy tonight. Some scattered showers continuing late tonight into tomorrow. For the West Valley's rain and then showers, it's a cloudy day today with some fog early. At times a little bit of sunshine, then mostly cloudy tonight, but we'll just call it a chance of showers as we go into the evening. And east of the Cascades, cloudy with rain and snow showers. Temperatures mainly in the 40s today with mostly cloudy skies later tonight and just a chance of showers late tonight into tomorrow. So for today, for the most part, Wednesday looking like a showery day, at least mainly in the morning, in the afternoon, and we'll call it a chance of showers Thursday. Less of a potential, but late Thursday into Friday, another round of rain. We'll have showers return for parts of Saturday and Sunday, and we'll start to dry out towards Monday and Tuesday. Also a little bit warmer as we go into Thursday and Friday. In the Klamath Basin, that will be the trend as well. Rain and snow showers mixing today, Thursday mostly dry, and then mainly rain showers for Friday and Saturday. More of a chance of rain and snow on Sunday and Monday. Northern California, rain and snow showers for today, dry on Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, bringing more rain. And out on the coast, could be a little windy at times today as well. So rain and wind today, showers tomorrow, and then more rain heading into the weekend.